guys want to see a magic trick? Let's start this day off with a magic trick. You guys ready? Where's Diesel? Bang! There's a Diesel! You popped right out of the air, man! Good magic trick! How'd you do that? It's the magic of editing, man. That is the magic of editing. It's a magic trick. I can't tell you how I did it. <laughs> okay, so where are we? North Carolina somewhere. Raleigh, North Carolina. And we're headed down to Charleston, South Carolina. And we gotta go. We gotta go right now. So we've made it, Charleston, South Carolina. You're always so pretty. Always such a nice looking city. Look at palm trees, palm trees. Very nice. I'd like to get out of this left lane, but the four wheelers don't think I need to be out of this lane. They think I should stay in this lane. I'm gonna put my signalatory device on. What do you know? Suddenly there's an open pass. Keep left on US 17. Oh, that would be left anyway, though. Okay. So here we go. Like these cities down here, they seem brighter than usual. I don't know if it's the sun, or the color of the buildings, or the palm Continue trees. Continue 1.6 kilometers, then keep left on to Folly Road Boulevard. The colors just seem brighter. Did I say that last time I was here, too? I think I did. Colors just seem so much brighter. Oh dear, lots of merging traffic. Oh wait, they get their own lane. Okay, so you don't really need to merge. You got your own lane. Stay in your lane. Thank you very much, I'm bigger. So this is the drawbridge. And I say it every time I meet a drawbridge or I drive over one, I wish I could stop right in the front row here and watch it lift. That would be cool. made it. Didn't fall in. This little weird cylinder building here is a Holiday Inn. In 700 meters, keep left up to Folly Road Boulevard. Aye aye, Mandy. That's a hotel. Isn't that cool? People living down here are so lucky. Look at all these palm trees and this weather. Man, I wish I could have palm trees in my yard like this. weather all year round. Man, that'd be nice. Look at that. It's beautiful. Keep left on to Folly Road Boulevard. Alright, well, we're almost to the destination. I guess we'll just uh, mosey our way on over there, unload, and then I'm headed over to Georgia like I... Uh, was thinking I would be. I'm going to Atlanta, then it sounds like I'm going up to Ontario, Canada. Ontario, Ontario. But first we gotta wait in this traffic. some sort of pilot McDonald's in South Carolina here. You know, I thought it was hot yesterday in North Carolina. Uh, I knew it would be hotter here, but I was right, it's hotter here. 
it's hot. Plus 30. Even with the air conditioning on, it feels hot. But we're gonna go spend some time outside anyways. We've been driving all day. Diesel, how's your day been? How's your day been, man? You wanna go outside? Well, you wanted to go outside the crazy second. I got your leash here. Yeah. Yeah, you put it on yourself, man. Put it on yourself. I don't know how to do that, man. You gotta help me. How to do everything for you. Diesel, I think you're about to go nuts. There's a pole. 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 There's more over there yet. Diesel, this is like rest stop heaven for you. I wonder what all these poles are. I wonder what all the poles are for. Oh, they got little holes on the top. Diesel's gonna go and sniff every single one. Got little holes in the top there. Maybe they got little buggers living in there, little small critters or something. Maybe they gotta air out the ground. I don't know. Maybe there's a bomb shelter. Maybe we're walking on top of a nuclear arms facility and that's their oxygen supply. <laughs> or not. I don't know. Diesel, what do you think? Huh. He thinks that they're here just for him. Uh, you're probably right, Diesel. They're probably here just for you. Gotta sniff every one. Maybe we should go get the big one over there, yes. The big pole. No? Oh, here's some long grass. Perfect for you, Diesel. Perfect. I couldn't imagine living down here in such awesome weather, like, all the time. Do you guys ever have bad weather days? Like, I'm not counting hurricanes. I know you guys got hurricanes, but other than hurricanes, like, do you guys ever get cold days down here? See, it's always nice. Every time I'm in this area of South Carolina, like, between North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, like, that strip there. What am I on, 995 or something? I don't know what I'm on. I don't know. But it's always perfect sunny weather and just hot. You guys are very lucky. And look at this. Right, the pile of truck stop over there. Nice big grass area here. I could let Diesel run around and be free here, but it's a little hot for him to be outside. I don't want him to be outside for too long. Don't want him to get sick now. That driver was staring at me. Why does everyone stare at a guy with a camera? I don't know. Does he want to be on camera? I'll put you on camera. No, I better not put him on camera. Anyways, Diesel, are you done? It's all out, buddy. Come on. Come on, man. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. So, it's been an uneventful day. At least we got the trailer empty. I just got to clean it up yet before going back. Uh, or bringing it to our, whatever, yard in Atlanta. And then I have a trailer there waiting for me. I'm gonna pick it up tomorrow morning at eight in the morning. Uh, apparently it's in a locked yard. So I gotta have a guy come and meet me there and unlock it for me. Otherwise I'd just pick it up tonight, right? Uh, whatever, I'll stay at the pilot there and somewhere in Atlanta. Actually, I hear that the truck stops around Atlanta are kind of dangerous. Is that true? Maybe we'll stay a little on this side of Atlanta. I don't know. We'll figure it out as we get there. Anyways. This is what it's like where I am. Hot. Oh, every winter, you forget how hot it gets in the summer, right? At least I do. So all winter, because uh, you got to idle the truck so much more in the wintertime to keep it warm, right? And all winter, I'm always looking forward to, yeah, summertime's coming. I won't have to idle the truck. And summertime gets here, it's so hot. Uh, APUs are great for that. But I've explained it in other videos already that I don't know if I'm gonna be adding an APU to this truck. Uh, just because it's so old, uh, I'll probably only have it for like a year or two and then I'll be upgrading into a better, newer truck. Uh, so, cause this truck's got two million kilometers on it or almost. In another six months, it'll have two million kilometers on it pretty close. It's quite a bit. And what is that in miles? That's, uh... What is that in miles? 2.2 million miles? Something like that? No! No! 2 million kilometers is not 2.2 million miles, Trucker Josh. Way to go. 2 million kilometers. 
I don't know. You have to figure it out. Goggle it. It'll tell you. There's my keys over there. There you go. Good boy, Diesel. Good catch. It's hot, isn't it? Yeah, we'll start up the truck right away. First, we're gonna make ourselves some peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Delicious. Two. Perfect. And juicy. Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Daisy, what'd you think about that? He was very interested the whole time I was making them. Very, very interested in what I was doing. Good boy. So yeah. We're gonna eat these now. Then we're gonna hit the road. We're not actually gonna hit hit the road, but you know what I mean. We're gonna drive on it. All right, let's get this thing back on the highway. The highway, all right here. Turn left onto I 26 uh -huh. East. I'm gonna turn left, turn right, Mandy. Sorry, turn left onto I 26 East. <laughs> you want me to go the other way and go do a U turn? It's a nice off ramp right here. Let's give her. Summer nights. Look at the sky. Look at the sky. You can't see any stars because it's Atlanta. Yeah, we're in Atlanta. That's what I don't like about big cities. You can't see any stars. It's so depressing. You're missing out on so much. Some people live their whole lives in cities. Can you believe that? Born in a city, grow up in a city, die in a city. Missing out on so much. I mean, I know that it's the most popular thing to do. That's why there's so many people in a city. But still, dude, you need to get out to the country. I'll tell you what, until you see the Milky Way galaxy with absolutely no light pollution, with minimal atmospheric interference, that's a term. I just made it up. It means it's a term. I don't know. I was thinking about the people like you guys who live in New York City. Big city. Beautiful city. Love that city. How many people do you think live and die without even ever leaving the city? That's crazy. I know there's people that do it. I know there's people in Winnipeg who've never left the city of Winnipeg. And it's Winnipeg. Get out explore that's what I'm saying that's my message to you guys today explore the world you only live once what are you looking at diesel what are you looking at what is that over there what is that that's a possum isn't it no an armadillo armadillo what is that Whoa, whoa, steady, trucker Josh, steady. Get your head out of the ground, you little bugger. I want to see what you are. You guys know what that is? You stay, Diesel. I'm going to go see how close I can get to it. Where's my hat? I need some camouflage. There we go. Now he won't see me coming. Dun, 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 dun. 
Dun, 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 dun. Stalking the beast. Ah! There's a spider web here. Ah! What is that? Look at that thing. How close are you gonna let me get, buddy? Look at that thing. I'm like five feet away from it. Dude, do you even know I'm here? Are you gonna like sting me or something? Hey buddy. Hey. How you doing? You are the strangest looking animal I've ever seen. No, don't be afraid. I'm not gonna kick you. Come back here. Look at that thing. I wanna see your face, buddy. What is he doing? You're just, you know, you and Diesel get along so well. Seems like you both love grass a lot. No, don't run away. What a weird looking animal. <laughs> Armadillo hunting. Diesel, did you see that, man? Did you see that? I could have reached out and touched him with my hand. Oh, you were afraid, weren't you, mate? I wasn't afraid. Okay, maybe a little. I don't know what they can do. What do they do? <laughs> do they sting you? Do they bite? Do they like karate chop you? I don't know. They're armadillos. I'm gonna have to Google it now. Watch, they're probably like the most poisonous thing on earth and I was standing like a foot away from it. <laughs> I doubt it. I really highly doubt they're poisonous. I'm pretty sure they're harmless. Like little bunny rabbits with armor. Diesel's like, you didn't even let me go play with it. You suck, man. You suck, I'm mad at you. This is my mad face. <laughs> you apparently never know what you're gonna find. Well, I just posted that I had my first experience with an armadillo. You guys are going crazy in the comment section like you usually do. <laughs> I should have poked it. Not hard, just see what it would do. Can you imagine? What if it would have gotten angry and chased me down the road? YouTube gold, man. Oh well, maybe tomorrow we see it. <laughs> Anyways, today is John Kluwer's 30th birthday. Happy belated birthday to you because you're seeing this video a week later. Happy birthday to John. Where are you from? Doesn't say, but you got a Dukes of Hazard car as your profile picture on Facebook. Sweet car. Is that you in the car? Nice. Happy birthday to you. And we're gonna go to bed now. Diesel, come here. You want a bone? I want a bone for you. Come get your bone. Come get your bone, man. Come here. You want your bone? Come get your bone, man. You can take it. Take it like a man. Watch the lights. Hey, no, you gotta, you gotta come get it. Up, all the way up here. Come on! Come get it, man. Oh. Come get it. What if I grab this end? Mm. Oh, that's weird, man. <laughs> take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. You want us? You gotta take it. Well, you gotta take it, man. Take it like a man! Okay, man. Uh, I'll take it. Take it. Get it. Get it. <laughs> just take it. What's the big deal? <laughs> it just takes him forever to take it out of my hand. Uh, anyways, guys, we'll see you tomorrow. 4 a.m. Central time for another vlog, just like today, but maybe different versions tomorrow. See you then.